Hey everybody, Night Gaming here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to teach you how to use the slash fill command. The reason I'm making a video on the slash fill command is it's kind of a command that no one uses that much. Like, I haven't seen that many people use it. People download world edit. Some people don't even know it exists. Slash fill is just a command used for um, professional building and stuff. And I thought it'd be a useful video if I showed you how to do it, because I didn't learn it until recently. Anyway, I'm just gonna get on with the video, because I don't know what else to talk about. Alright, so I spawned uh, next to a village, but it, that doesn't matter. We can just go far away. I chose a super flat world, because it's the easiest world to demonstrate this command in. Just because it's super flat, I guess. So basically, the first thing you want to do is you want to look at where you want to start your, you know, build, I guess. And you want to look at it with your crosshair, and you want to type slash fill, and then, then press tab three times. The reason you press tab three times is because it's going to automatically type in the coordinates for where you're looking at. So you just do that, then you press enter. Now, what you do is, if you want to build like a cube or a wall, uh, you just have to go to where you want to end your wall, I guess. And just I'm just going to build it up here. So I'm going to look at this block, and I'm going to press tab three times again. Oh wait, yeah. Press T, and then press the uh, up arrow key on your keyboard and it'll take you to the last thing that you typed out. So it'll have the coordinates automatically there and you won't have to remember it or write it down. So once you do that, just press tab three times again. And then choose what block you want. I guess I'll do diamond block. And then there we go, we have a wall of diamond. But that's not the only useful thing about this. You can make cubes. like not just walls, you can make like cubes of blocks, I don't know. So yeah, you look at the block, press T, slash fill, tab three times, enter, look at where you want to end it, T, up, tab three times, and then whatever block. I'll do stone this time. And there, there we go, we got a cube of stone. This can also be useful for removing things. Like, I can do slash fill, tab three times, enter. And then I can do it again. But this time, instead of doing a block data value, I can just put air, and it'll get rid of everything. I think this is a really useful command, and I just wanted to make a quick video showing how to use it. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. 